All right, hello, my name is Apollos, and welcome back to more Heartbringer. So, it has been a while since we were last here, so I'm going to recap you. Basically, the last few seconds, or the last few minutes of what we did in the last episode. God damn it, I can't talk. Uh, we were inside this uh, little um, factory area, or like moon base. After doing many trials and escaping freaking AIs and planet monsters, we finally reached outside, and now we are here. And this is an alien ship it looks like, so we gotta tread carefully. So let's continue now. A golem deployed force here seems to be blocking the entrance to the canned habitat. It's likely being powered by one of the nearby ships. Perhaps there's a way to disable it. Gotcha, gotcha. We're trying to find a way to blow up the ship is what I'm gathering from. How do I... It, oh, it looks like the golem ship is now about to go critical and may be best to step away from it. Okay. Hey, it's blowing up. Oh, uh, what a bad design for a freaking... Oh, uh, for a spaceship. For it to blow up with like a few press of the buttons? God damn it. Oh, hello. Secret area over here, maybe. You got a gem for capture the gem. It would drop... Uh, bacon. Cool, cool. Uh, can I go... Oh, no, no, I can't. Oh, that's the secret. God damn, can't see anything. Hello? Ooh, looked all. We're gonna get rid of you first. And we're in. Hello, okay. Let me read this stupid thing. Uh, you finally made it to the control, uh, the command habitat. Bodies filled the floor. It seems there were no survivors. You decide to attempt to send a warning to Earth. The console in the middle of the room may be able to do that. Uh, the communication network seems to be offline. According to the information on the panel, power has to be has been cut from the comm array and the dish needs to be realigned. Power can be reached by taking the elevator down while the dishes can be okay. Let's go up I guess. Hello. You find yourself in front of the uh, satellite alignment array. According to display, the science switch in the middle will begin the aligning process which is sure to uh, attract unwanted attention. The red monitoring station needs to be defended until the alignment is complete. If they are hit four times, the alignment will fail and need to be restarted. The green bar in the center indicates how much time is remaining in the procedure. There are four defenses. Please assist you. Okay. Oh, the gem is here. Looks like it can be used. Vent sealed. Bro, this is like Five Nights of Freddy's. There we go. We have one more of those, so... Should be fine. Hey, we're done. Okay, here we go. You see a backup generator to the left. Perhaps if you can re... Route it, uh, the reroute the power flow to the reactor pylon. Oh, it's one of those, isn't it? It's going to be a painful puzzle. Oh, uh, we can keep reading up here, is it? Upper right. I think, yeah, we got to do up there. So, what the hell, man? This is going to take, like, many brain. Yeah, so this is gonna be like a no talking part of the video. So I'm just gonna cut when I'm done with this thing. And we're good. Let's get the hell out of here. Switch. Save point reach. You explain to the Admiral that you uh, you came from the SS Victory and worked your way, blah, blah, blah. So, uh, we finally, it's good to finally reach someone on base. We've been trying for days. We send rescue um, parties, but it's impossible. I'm uploading some command codes. Uh, that should get you into the security area of the habitat. I need you to work your way into the turret's react core and overload it. Uh, what? The golems must have intercepted your transmission and disabled the point. The panel that will open the door, you look around and don't see any way to open the door. Perhaps there's another way around it, okay. Oh, there's a thing over here, damn. Okay. Okay, we did it. Jesus Christ, man. There we go. We peered at the monitors. It seems that the core receiver coolant from the upper segment is uh, disabling the key points might disrupt the coolant supply. You also figured the core may be vulnerable to some good old fashioned explosions. A coolant disrupted. Good, good. Hey, there we go. We got one in. There we go. Hey, so we have five seconds to do everything. 
Hey. So for some god knows reason, I muted my mic and like decided not to unmute it. So I'm gonna be describing what happens uh, to this rest of the video in like third person for a sec. So after destroying the last two red buttons, the top floor of the reactor opened up, allowing the access of the last four buttons to be pressed and to destroy the reactor. Finally causing the place to melt down, there he quickly escaped into the exit hatch where he has to make a fifth decision to choose between going on the rail carts where bombs are going to be exploding and going to the maintenance shaft where possibly bombs will be exploding. He chose the ladder and decided to go into the railway cart only to be stopped and destroyed by the bomb because he couldn't get over a stupid barrier. He then proceeds to die and is teleported to the end credit where some god knows reason people blame me for the fall of earth even though I did my best to save it. Oh yeah, spoiler alert. Uh, Earth uh, still dies in the end, so, you know, whoops. And then we reach the conclusion. So, there you go. You're caught up. So, back to you, past me. Oh my god, I was muted the whole time. C rank. Okay, you know what? I'll accept that. Hey. You know what? That's a passing grade. Wow, damn. That was an epic map. It had its ups and downs, but, you know. It's okay. We get to finally explore the map now. I died here, man. Okay, you know what? We teleported here for a reason. We're going to explore the map around first. I want to see what we did at the end of the thing. We got a C rank though, so it didn't really matter. Wow. This could have been me doing some epic battles, but I suck on freaking uh, rail cards. Oh, wow. Okay, we're doing a different thing. Nah, this is the ending we wanted. Wow, let's do this. Let's see if they have a different story for each thing. Uh, with the moon defense can disable, you were able to safely, okay. Just in time. It wasn't long until the Martian uh, arrived, unable to establish foothold. The Martian base assaulted her directly, despite human. Uh, you, your victory uh, will earn you a medal. Instead, you're being awarded with more uh, action soon. Wow, so that was the ending that we were supposed to get. So we're gonna wrap things up here. Uh, my name is Apollo. If you enjoyed what you saw, go ahead, like, comment, subscribe, and all that good stuff. And yeah, I will play more adventure maps. Uh, suggest some things down below. And hey, the New Year's is gonna start off, so might expand out some other things too like i don't know i had some videos that are not really gaming related in mind so i might just do them see how they float and if they do good i might do more who knows i'm still a newborn channel who doesn't have an actual destination right now but yeah uh check out the links in below to get this map uh kind of uneventful ending right there how i just died so my b and yeah i will talk to you all later